know about you, but when I come to the beach, this isn't what I expect to see. Nor do I expect to smell the noxious, god-awful smell that I'm having to smell right now. This is the first sign of former life that I've seen today. This is a jellyfish. And you can see the size of it. Um, that's the first of those I've even seen today. Virtually nothing else alive. This is Denise. We're in Long Beach, Mississippi. The afternoon of January 8th, Saturday. More in a moment. Also should be noted um, that uh, none of the BP workers I have met uh, or run into on this beach since the very beginning of the oil spill, not one of them has had any kind of respirator or face mask even um, on. They, every single one, they've had uh, uh, protective headgear, uh, like, you know, like a, almost like a net over there, like they're going to pre be preparing food. Um, they have had, um, and sometimes like a hard, a light hard hat. Um, they have been wearing gloves and the little booty things over their uh, shoes and the uh, paperish uh, coveralls um, and of course the gloves but, uh, but nothing, nothing whatsoever for the vapors uh, or breathing. This is Denise. We're in Long Beach, Mississippi. January 8th. Saturday. Hank! Hi, buddy. Hello, my buddy Hank. How we doing? How we doing, Hank? Whoa. Guess what I got? Catfish? I'm gonna give you some in a minute. Alright. We have an oily sheen. We have a horrible stench. And we have two seagulls down here. One seagull right here. Hank. Hi, Hank. Hey, buddy! And one seagull just flew over. And that's it. For birds. There are some kids on the gazebo over to my left here. And Hank is not so sure. <laughs> huh, Hank? It's all right, buddy. They have a scooter.